Okay, Andreas, how are things going? Listen, uh, I'm going to just run down. I'm going to put all the tunes on the same video for you. So we're going to start with... Uh, uh, this is uh, Fresh, very simple. Uh, B minor, G, uh, and then F sharp. So uh, basically, 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 it starts out with the theme tone. That's what I'm going to be doing over top of And what I thought you could do is some rhythmic cool stuff, you know, that... Uh, anyways, you, you're good at all that kind of stuff, so, uh, and just look... These kind of little licks uh, underneath and uh, pulling us in and out of the sections, uh, sort of jamming, playing around with the lyrics. Every single part is the same, except for the chorus. It goes fresh, 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 exciting. Now we put a major seven because they've got the little. Da -da 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 -da. And I thought you could uh, scat that like Benson. Uh, you could even throw in a lot of licks, scat licks like that, like you did in Ragdoll in this tune. I really like that. So it'd be fresh, fresh. And the, you know, just fool around with it, have fun, and just remember the changes in the chorus when we do the fresh, fresh. Uh, it, it it goes to F uh, or uh, G major seven to G six, and then to F uh, sharp seven. So fresh, fresh, exciting. And the theme comes in always after. Then there's a little breakdown. After the second theme, we're gonna go to uh Fresh as a summer breeze. They're just all inversions of, of G to A. We go up to the third inversion, plug on a, a G6, and then Christian will take his solo over the same progression. You, you'll see it's like on the album. We do it quite a bit faster than the album version, actually. And uh, what is it? And then you'll do your solo after. And we'll do like. And now I say this is Christian Robert. Then I say, introduce you, sort of, and you, uh, you take your solo. We do the, another theme, and then we end the song like we did on the album and stuff. Anyways, very simple, very easy. Uh, I mean, I'm sure, I'm sure you'll have no problems with this. Um, now, part time lover. Uh, it's in B minor, or B flat minor, I should say. So these are basically the all the chords to F. Flat to F. So we do. Simplified a little bit. There's no passing chords. Straight up like that a couple times, and then we punch from uh, A flat minor seven to D uh, flat seven into the G flat a major seven. Then we go to so basically that's uh, D flat D flat major seven D diminished. The reverse uh, second inversion of uh, B flat. Uh, then we go. So just run the chorus again. sort of goes into my solo uh, and then after you can um, after my solo you'll take your solo and then we can uh, we do an out uh, and then it sort of ends like on the album so very easy so those are all the voicings again for the chorus so you 
got in, we got the suspended chord in F there uh, just before the solos. Uh, and uh, when Christian does his vocal thing at the end of every uh, chorus. So that's Part Time Lover. Um, now we'll go over uh, Let's Groove Tonight. So th it's pretty much the same. I'm giving you a lot of these cool kind of R&B kind of tunes because uh, uh, I know you like scatting and you're going to have your uh, arch tops, so you're going to have some fun. And you asked me for some tunes that are a little more in the groove. Uh, less, le There's less changes. This one has a little more going on, but it's very, very simple still. Um, so E minor 9 to A7 to G6. Uh, F sharp minor 7th to B7 sharp 9. And then, then we walk it down. So that'd be E minor 9, D7, C minor 7, flat 5. What? 7 flat 5, then we've got, uh, so what was it? Then F, um, F7, sharp, sharp 9, to B7. So basically we've got... vocal trumpet there um, so we'll, we'll do that there and uh, that's over the same chords the whole time and then it's got that. so it just runs through that progression the whole pretty much the whole song uh, there's a cool thing if you have time if not I can do it but we do So was it slowly? It's Like I said, you can fool around with little licks, uh, you can groove with us, uh, rhythmically, whatever. So th those are all the sections. The second time after uh, I'll, uh, the, the, the chorus, I do a solo. You can do a solo after, uh, it's, or we can check it out when we get to uh, why, where we're going to put the solo. I don't know, whatever feels nice. I do the solo like on the album, um, and, and then there's, when we do, we come back after the, I think of the second. Uh, no, the third chorus, we... <laughs> then we go to the bridge. Now the bridge is, uh, rhythmically it's different, we do a... Uh... Back to the uh, the original progression, so that would be A minor uh, seven, uh, no A minor nine with that voicing. We've got B minor seven uh, with the E on top. So with the the eleven, I guess, and then um, to the nine. So. up to C, the same chords, so uh, it'll be a C, a C minor, uh, C, C minor 9, up to the D minor 7 with a, a G on top with the 11, and then minor, uh, minor 9, a G, a couple, we do that two times, so... So 
basically for a C minor seven to B uh, B seven, and then and then basically that's how the song uh, that that's all the changes. So uh, and then we've got one which you know. So fool around with that. I just wanted to drop all that stuff for you so you'd uh, you know exactly the the changes, the voicings, whatnot. Have fun with it, uh, listen to the versions, think what you're going to do, and let's just have fun, man. I tried to give you the stuff that'll be, uh, that you'd like to play, and uh, it grooves, buddy. So uh, take it easy, and we'll, uh, I'll see you on the second. Cheers, man.